What's up everybody? Today, I'll be your mixologist. That's right, I'm Andre. This is Edible Fitness, the fitness that you can eat. And we are making mocktails. These are perfect for the summertime, and so I'm excited to get started. As you can see, I've got a bunch of stuff here, lots of different flavorings. Um, I may not use all of them, but just to show you that you can create a ton of different things. This is rhubarb, I'm excited about this one. Blueberry, strawberry here, not a lot left. Blackberry, a little bit thicker is our kiwi. This one is really good. Some Perrier, orange juice, coconut. It's gonna be good, it's gonna be good. So, let's get started. All right, we're gonna start off with the rhubarb. So, open up your simple syrup. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Please don't let this spill out. <laughs> okay, yeah, we're good. Ah. Making these syrups are totally easy, and before we begin with the rhubarb drink, I'm gonna show you how I made this one. I had about five stalks of rhubarb. I washed them and then I diced them into small pieces. After I did that, I got a pot, put them into the pot and added water, half of a lemon, sugar, cloves, and vanilla. And then I let that simmer on a low heat for about 45 minutes. You don't actually need 45 minutes. 30 minutes is good, but I figure, what's it gonna hurt, 45 minutes? So I let it simmer for 45 minutes, and then I use a sieve, let the juice run out, and uh, let it cool before putting it into the fridge. Put it into this wonderful mason jar and cooled it down. And voila, rhubarb syrup. And I changed the recipe slightly for the others, for the blackberries, the blueberries, and the strawberries. I'll leave all of that on the website so you can check out exactly what I did. First, start with your ice. I'm gonna try to not get the sides, as I did, but who cares, whatever. Then you're gonna take your spritzer. This one is so easy, guys, this is great. There you go. Up next is our blueberry ginger. As you can see, you've got ginger beer and a blueberry syrup. So we're gonna start with the ice again. Pour that right in. Oh, that's so great. Add the ginger beer because uh, you gotta be a little bougie sometimes. These are wild strawberries. So I'm gonna take a couple of them. There you go, blueberry ginger. This is the orange creamsicle. Once again, we're starting with the ice. We're getting a little more fun, a little more excited. So it's up to you how much ice you want. I'm gonna add in a couple of cubes here. Now I'm gonna add in the coconut and about half a cup of orange juice. It smells incredible. There you have it, your orange creamsicle. Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. Number four, strawberry kiwi, kiwi at the bottom. Now to this, I'm gonna add in some more seltzer. Use a spoon so you don't upset the kiwi too much. Again, use the spoon. This should be, if everything works out, our third layer. But there you go, your strawberry kiwi. And there you have it. Four awesome mocktails for the summer, for dinners, for barbecues, for quick little get-togethers, whatever. There you go. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and leave a comment downstairs. Also, don't forget to hit that notification bell so you always know when I upload new, delicious, bougie little videos just like this one. 
All right, guys, remember to love your drinks, love your life, and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.